It's a place I've only heard about and dreamed about coming. And now I live five hours away and I'm spending the weekend out here shed hunting. up on this awesome little overlook. My plan is to sit here and just glass all of this. And then I'm gonna hop on the other side of this ridge and eventually pop out on the other side of that green pond back to where I started. In the meantime, I'm gonna get the binos and snacks out. I got the chills right now. Oh my gosh, I don't know how I just Oh, yes! Oh my gosh, I don't even know. I just happened to look this way too. Oh my gosh. Let's go. Elk shed on the board. First ever elk shed. Oh my gosh. Yes! I'm so excited right now. Oh my gosh. This is freaking awesome. Oh, I was just sitting here thinking like how awesome this was. And I, I just took that little uh, other video right up there and yes one two three four five sixer oh let's go let's go oh my gosh <laughs> oh my gosh let's go i'm so stoked right now look at that thing look at that thing Yes! Yeah, I can't believe it. Oh, I can't believe it. I can't believe it. Oh my gosh. All right. I can't. I can't. Just found a little two point newly deadhead. I hiked right up here. I stopped right there, took a drink of water, looking all around this. And I go, okay, I'm going to take this trail. And there you have it. Take a look to my right and muley deadhead. Is it worth packing? Sure, why not? Got all sorts of junk down here on the bases. Would have been a nice deer one day. It's too bad. I almost just told myself to drop down into this timber. Then I was like, no. I'm gonna keep walking along this fence line up on top so I can see. Good call, Jace, good call. Nice four point muley shed. Dang, I'm on a roll now. Let's go, baby. Not the biggest, but my first mule deer shed. Yay! Nice little guy. I'll shoot him. I'll shoot him. Beaut. Now I need to find some fresh ones. Now I'm just getting real lucky. So I finally kind of looped all the way back around. You can see there's that green field, pond. Walking in this thick stuff, just kind of, just kind of trotting around. And I came right on point to this guy. Second muley shed. Let's go. I've just been carrying around that deadhead. Nice. Solid little dude. This is awesome. Ah, look at that country. Finding muley sheds out here. This has been an amazing trip. Wow. Maybe I'll stomp around up here a little more and see if I can't come across the match. I mean, I know it's pretty old, so the matching set could be long gone, but who knows, this stuff's kind of thick. You won't really see it unless you happen to walk in the right lane. Nice. Day two, and 
so far so good covering some amazing country eating some good snacks i'm a little hungry so i'm trying to conserve i don't have that many snacks on me no antlers yet today physically my feet are toast just bad blisters on these puppies so new boots and then i guess figure out a way how to walk in boots Without getting blisters is the game plan. To do this many miles, you're gonna need feet that uh that last. So luckily today's the last day, otherwise I wouldn't be wouldn't do too many miles tomorrow probably. There we go, that's why we're out here working hard all day. My feet are freaking fried. I stood there for about two minutes now just thinking if I should go down here and sit down and eat lunch or go down this way. And I chose this way, took a look to my left. Oh my god, let's go! Yes, baby, that looks like a brown too. Oh my lord. Oh my gosh. This is so worth it. You don't even understand. I can't even describe how much pain I've been in all day. My feet are so blistered from yesterday. But this beauty this is a freaking beauty I'm gonna have to scan this spot for the match oh my gosh guys yes this is a stud this is a freaking stud Thank you. 